Hello. Let's see what we've got here. Oh, got here. So, we're back at the dungeon. We're mining um, skeletons. We've got water flowing all around this place. We haven't really engaged with the uh, lava yet. I think this is going to work out fine. You can see we've got the whole building here. They're all over there in the back corner. And there's actually a little drop off there. So what I do is I go down here and I can go down and have a fight with these guys. Basically, I'm gonna hit them. So you can get these guys, they can hit me. And I get them. They got nowhere to go. They sit down here, they got nowhere to go. Look, done. Nice little hole here. And basically I just keep on picking up arrows, killing these guys, and then I have my downstairs where I can go and fetch my stuff. See my hopper? Nothing there at the moment. See, it's just sticking there. Why is it just sticking there? I should just go and, uh, okay, I know what I'm going to do. This is dumb. I need the arrows to come down here. Why isn't it coming down? That's dumb. Stupid. Stupid traps. Stupid. I need a way to get that. Well, anyway, this is what I want to show you. The method so far, we're going to get better at it, obviously. See if I can get down there. I've got to fix this up. I actually need this moved, I think. I think the hopper moved up there. So it's closer. Okay, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to move the hopper. Made a decision for me, peeps. Sick of this garbage. Garbage. So this is interesting. Sometimes when the skeletons hit each other, they actually get into a fight and they kill each other. That makes things a lot easier. Well, I can go up there, but I really want the hopper to work. This is stu stupid. Stupid. I want the hopper to work. Hopper's not going to work while you're doing this garbage. Hmm. Alright. I'm going to fix up this trap. I'm going to continue uh, mining these guys and we'll get back to you. So we perfected it a little bit. I'll show you what we've done. We've sealed this up a little bit. We've got stairs. We've got three killing points. Three killing windows. We've built up the wall. You can see the balls are built up right over there. Oh, you're getting me. All right, go around the back. And uh, you can see the wall, and I've built a lower one. You go, how do you do that? Well, you dig down the bottom, you stick a bucket in, seal it up, essentially. So I'm using this to get my uh, arrows up. like that and then if I go downstairs
Got my arrows. Got my arrows and a thing. I've got 49. When I get to 64, we're going to make start working on the um, Enderman. Come on. Yeah, when they get in the water, they can't help but move. Oh god, that was a tough one. Stop hitting me. Not very nice, are they? All this bread. Money. And I keep on gaining life as well, which is always important. And I go down here. We're gonna go down. See? And I get really close to the hopper, I get all thing. 59. Look at that, we're nearly there. Four more arrows. You can't do the same thing you did in the other one. Oh, that hurt. You can't do the same uh, setup as the zombies. Because these guys can shoot. So you have to just do. The, we're going to do it in this strategy. I have one where it closes up and they have to fight and I, get, I can knock them out. Oh man, you hurting me. Stop hurting me. Jeez. Just give me your arrows. One. There we go. I've also got further shoot here. Can't get me here. They can't get me at this one. This one they can't even hit me at. The enclosure. This one, yes. Yep, yeah, ow. Got me again. Stop being a meanie. And just give me your uh, arrows. There we go. Any more? Alright, none. Let's have a look down the thing again. Sixty-one arrows. Nice. Nearly there. Ah, oh, those arrows hurt, man. Those arrows hurt. Deep. Alright, I think we've got enough. Let's see. Two. Sixty-four. We're past it. We're going to leave you here. We're going to leave the arrows. We'll take, keep the arrows. And now we're going to head back home to our base. See you guys. We'll catch you next time, skeletons. And we'll head back to the base. I'm gonna see you there. So there is, I'm back at the village. You can see the trees have grown. I'm back at the village to do one last thing, and that is to assemble an iron golem. So, Previously, I would go. I went into here, and I was able to assemble iron blocks. I've got four of them over here. I'll show it to you right here. My four iron blocks, and I also have a pumpkin. I went back to my village to bring all this back, but during that all that time, I was able to do all that work. So what I want to do now is I want to create an island golem so that these villages can be safe so basically the body is a a little t like this and then you got to place the guy at the top I wonder if i can do that maybe i'll get another brick Ugh. seems like i'm short all right are you going to do it or maybe i'll go up here there you go much better why did i think of this before all right here we go look golem there we go this will mean that these villages will be now safe from monsters. We don't want monsters. I've got my bed up here. And uh, then I can go to sleep. But I just wanted to show you that little bit as well. So that will conclude... Uh, I don't know, I think we're up to day 65, 66. Um, and now we're on day 66, I think. And now we're going to start our work on enchanting our weapons and hunting Endermen for the Enderstone, Enderman Eye, I think it is. 
so we can locate the fortress.